We can go ahead and power on the unit by holding the power button on top for a few seconds. The unit will take some time to boot up. In the meantime, we'll move on to the apps. There are two apps for the Redium Go. One is the Go app, which is used for voice and messaging, and the Redium Mail and Web app to send and receive emails or acquire weather data. Before we can use either app, we must first connect to the unit's Wi-Fi connection. So we'll go into our settings and go to our Wi-Fi settings. The unit will not broadcast the Wi-Fi access point if the antenna is not deployed. So we'll go ahead and deploy the antenna now. As you can see, the unit is still initializing. Just a few. There we go. Now we just need to wait for our radium connection to appear. Here we are, a radium 11209. 11209 is the serial number of the unit. Now that we're connected to the Wi Fi, we can access the Go by using the Go app and logging in by using the default username and password of guest guest. I also wanted to point out this number here on the LCD screen at the top. This indicates how many users are logged into the unit. Once we log in with the Go app, that zero shall turn into a one. The reading requires direct line of sight with the satellite. Since we are in a building, we won't be able to acquire signal. But once you do acquire signal and register it onto the network, placing a call is simple. Simply tap the call application, enter zero zero, the country code you're trying to dial, for instance, the country code of the United States is 1, followed by the area code and phone number. And then you would just press the green button to initiate the phone call. To send an email, we would use the mail-in web app. The mail-in web app requires a separate username and password. You can register for an account on Iridium's website. We will provide a link below. Once you have your username and password, go ahead and enter your credentials into the app. It'll tell you an additional configuration is needed to select the device we are going to use. Since we're using the Iridium Go, we're going to go ahead and leave it at Iridium Go. We're now ready to compose an email. To compose an email, simply click on the Mail app and tap the pencil icon here. Enter the email address you would like to send subject and body. Now we need to send the, the message to the outbox. You can have multiple messages in the outbox. To send the messages in the outbox, you must press the arrow icon here and perform a send and receive session. Again, you will need signal and to be registered to the network in order to send and receive emails. To power off the unit, lower the antenna and it will start the countdown for shutting off.